Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of OMSI 2. Today we're down on Add-on London and we're going to be driving the 415 from Tulse Hill Gyratory through to Bricklayer's Arms. We're in the Studio Polygon uh, MMC, Enviro 400 MMC and uh, this is version 1.2, uh, the updated version and uh, we're going to be taking a look as to how uh, the ADL variant performs uh, in Add-on London today. Uh, last time, i.e. yesterday, we had a look at the Scania variant and uh, yes, today we're going to be looking at the uh, the ADL variant. So there we go, let's get some lights on so we can see where we're going and uh, get the, uh, the old braking, there we go. Are we in, uh, hang on, have I put it in neutral? No, I haven't, there we go. Uh, helps if you put it in neutral. Uh, unfortunately, we're having to use a white livery today because uh, the new version of the bus will break all your liveries unfortunately it's very similar to when the uh, when the street light was updated uh, unfortunately it will break all of your liveries uh, we're gonna have uh, yeah there we go stop so uh, yeah plain white for us we've got the roller blind on there we've got an absolutely fantastic uh, exterior model it's been completely remodeled from the ground up from what uh, from what I've been led to believe I think we've got things like uh, bonnet can open. Ooh, look, there you go. There's an engine in there. That's what keeps us moving. And uh, yeah, apart from that, full new interior. Uh, we've got different set bars. Uh, I think. Uh, oh, hang on. Is it having to think about it? There we go. So this is obviously London spec. We've got TFL boards in there. Uh, yeah, it should be red. But unfortunately, it's not. It's white, and we're just going to have to. Uh, we're just going to have to. Get, uh, we're just going to have to accept that for today until some repaints are made. Uh, now we are actually running late, so let's get those doors shut. There we go, and uh, off we go. It's been that long since I've driven uh, OMSI 2 out on London. I need the directional arrows on because I'm not really too sure where I'm going. Uh, I believe as well, this doesn't seem to have it unless I've just pressed it, but uh, the ADL version will have. A, uh, where you have to put the foot, your foot on the foot brake uh, when you've closed the doors in order to take the handbrake off. And now I don't know if maybe London have ordered it without that on, uh, but this particular version I'm driving doesn't seem to have that feature, uh, unless I've just not noticed it. There we go, let's, uh, let's get pulling over there. We're using the ZF version today, uh, because obviously that's what London ordered. Oh, low temperature. Yeah, it's January, love. Of course it'll be low temperature. Yeah, there we go. We don't seem to have the uh, the foot on the foot brake thing with this version of the bus. Uh, sounds have been completely improved. I mean, just listen to that engine. It sounds absolutely fantastic. Uh, the ADL version, I don't think sounds quite as good as the Scania. Uh, that's not Studio Polygon's fault. That's just how it is, isn't it? There we go. We need to go straight on there. Or is it a Voith, this one? I think it is a Voith, isn't it? Oh, we're in the Voith version today. Yeah, of course we are. You can hear it there. I didn't know they had Voith versions in London. I thought they were all ZF, but there we go. Uh, I don't know a lot about London uh, London buses in general, to be honest with you. Uh, but there we go. So yeah, we're in the Voith version today, not the ZF, uh, which is good because it gives us uh, a chance to drive the Voith version because the Scania was uh, ZF last time. So you can hear the the differences in the gearboxes there. There we go, let's get those doors shut. Uh, I think I accidentally opened the back doors. No, I didn't. Right, okay, there we go. Oh, I don't know what's happening there. It's, it, how many gears does this thing have? It seems like it's it's kind of jerking up and down the gears like a ZF would, but it's uh, it, it sounds like a voice. Definitely sounds like a voice, doesn't it? Uh, of course, we do have the uh, this. Hang on, let's uh, there we go. Temporary bus stop. Do you know what? I've completely forgotten this route. <laughs> completely forgotten this route. There we go. We'll, we'll pop the lights on. We've got this destination controller up here to pop your destination in. That's not a destination controller, that's your announcements. There's your destination controller, uh, which is all jolly nice. And, uh, of course, we've got a Wayfarer machine. I have got ticketing turned off in London, uh, because otherwise I can't keep to time. Uh, it's like Arcala, but worse. 
And uh, yeah, I didn't really tend to drive this bus. I know I have done a video in the past of us on uh, London in this bus. But I always struggled with the frame rates on the old version. I really, really did. Uh, but since first Enviro and uh, the, other, the other chaps at Studio Polygon, uh, our reverse idle, uh, since they've gone and uh, sorted this out for version 1.2, you really do notice how much the frame rates have just improved. I mean, London, I thought we'll, we'll take it for a spin on London to see how it performs, because London is notoriously one of the worst maps for frame rates, probably because it's very busy, but also because I think the developers uh, could do with a little bit more optimising. Well, maybe not the developers, but the map could do with a bit more optimising. Um, and... So I thought we'll take this for a spin and see how we get on. And so far, we're doing all right. I mean, it might absolutely drop through the floor when we get near Elephant King and uh, Elephant and Castle. There we go. Hang on. You see how I mean? The the gears are kind of whizzing up and down. Hey, dear me! But that is the um in mis unmistakable. I can't even speak this evening. It's been a long day. Uh, the unmistakable sound of a voice screaming its way down the hill. There we go. I have absolutely no idea where we are. No, of course I do. We're on the 432 route. I don't remember those roadworks there. They probably were always there. I don't think London's had an update, has it? I mean, the January update's due from last year. We're on the 12 months behind schedule. Shall we have a, a bit of a photograph there? Mm. That's nice, isn't it? Nice photo. Brilliant. There we go. Right, get that door shut. Get the uh, directional arrows back on so we can see where we're going. Nope, somebody wants to get off. The stopping bell sounds sound a lot better as well. I mean, I don't like the stopping bell on these things. I think it's just irritating. Some people do, some people don't. It's just, just my opinion. Uh, but yeah, the uh, that's all been improved. It, it seems to echo a bit more, like you are actually on a bus. Before it was very... Um, like a, a generic sound, whereas now it's very much a case of... Uh, oh, hang on, Brixton Water Lane, here we go. Ah, we're not too far from Brixton now, then. Well, of course not, probably not. You know the Sainsbury's Joe's where you are. There we go, get the back doors open as well so that people can get off. And although it's a timing point, I think we can leave a little bit early, don't you? There we go. Full steam ahead. See how it gets on going through the centre of Brixton. You see, it definitely seems to go up the up the gears like a Z. I'm very confused. Maybe it's just a new version of the Void gearbox. I'm not too sure. It's just very bizarre. Ooh, it's having to think about it there, isn't it? Marvel Road. Straight off. Go, go, go. Ah, yes. We go down to Brixton, then we turn left and then right, don't we? Because there's like a little, uh, like a little, te a little square, isn't there? We're keeping the bus lane. Oh, it's not liking this at all, is it? It's. Uh, there we go. Get them doors open. We'll just open two as default now, I think, because there's always going to be someone wanting to get off, isn't there? There we go. Two closed. Oh, I'm sorry, love. You've missed your stop now. Oh, hang on. The, the ding, ding, but there's nobody walking down the stairs. What's happening there, then? Nobody stood at my door, is there? How bizarre. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, having to have quite a few thinks about it, isn't it? Like I say, I don't think we should write it off as being the bus at this point, because again, let's not forget where we are. It's quite funny, we actually did the uh, the 432 run from Brixton up to Annerley uh, not too long ago, and uh, we didn't see many of the buses that are featured in Add-on London. Uh, it was, we saw Sateno City Golds, we saw, uh, I think, did we see a street light? I can't remember. Uh, but it was very, very weird. Uh, we were expecting to see Gemini 3s and street decks. Oh, that would be the curb, Joe. And uh, we didn't really see any of them. Down in this neck of the woods, anyway. Uh, we saw plenty of, uh, of root, well, new root masters, as they're otherwise known. What's this over here? Lambeth Civic... Oh, right, so you get a photograph of the Civic Centre. Well, do you know what we're going to do, actually? Uh, Lambeth Civic Centre. We are going to have... Uh, a photograph. Possibly. Of the bus. About there. There we go. We'll, we'll pause it for a second. And uh, we will... Ah, lovely. That's very nice, isn't it? Splendid. Right, there we go. Uh, that is a screenshot saved. Although I don't know, that, is that saving the screenshot? It looks like it's just a blank blank picture. There we go. No, oh, I don't know what's happening. It's just saving black pictures now. How bizarre. There we go. Can we... Ah, oh, there we go. It's working. No, it's working. Right, okay. There we go. Back to it. Back to it. Ah, lovely. Right, so 4.45, that stops there, not us. Uh, 4.15, ah, there we go. Lambeth Town Hall, zero. There we go, it says stop request, but nobody seems to be getting off. What, what are you doing stood there, uh, my friend? Are we, uh, yeah, what's happening there? You stood by the back door. Oh, doesn't that sound absolutely fantastic from the outside, though? There we go, so coming down through Brixton now. I mean, this is one of the places where we're going to struggle for performance, because there's a lot going on here. There we go, there's a, a new route master in a, a promotional livery there on the right. What's to say we're not in a promotional livery? We are uh, promoting simplicity. You know, just plain white. Plain white. No frills. Absolutely no frills at all. I wonder uh, if we go inside the buildings... Oh, right, okay, yeah. I was going to say, I wonder if... I mean, that could be one of the reasons why this is quite poorly optimised, because there's there's all this building round here. If we take a look at, at Arcala, for instance, uh, all of this wouldn't exist, and it is just a, a front for the buildings, isn't it? So maybe the, if they took all of... Oh, look, a southeastern train. If they took all of this out from behind the buildings so that the driver can't actually see it, you know, like, there's all this over here, all the roofs and everything like that. You don't actually technically need to see it, unless it's a roof like that where you can't see it from the ground. Uh, but any any bits of the building you're not going to see, you could probably take out just to improve performance, because there's less things to be loaded in, isn't there? That's one of the reasons that I reckon Arcala performs as well as it does, because uh, he's been quite clever with it. I mean, I don't think personally we're going to see any more updates for Adon London. I think, uh, I know that we were promised quite a few things, weren't we? We were promised... Um, a regional variant of the Enviro 200. Uh, that was meant to be coming out last year. We've not seen that. Um, they have announced that they've completely stopped development of the London City Bus 400, which uh, is a real shame, actually. You know, it's it's a real shame that they've just dropped it. I mean, I'd, I'm hoping I'll be proved wrong. 
with the likes of thinking there's never going to be an update. I, I'm hoping, I mean, they did say January update. They didn't specify which January, so maybe it's a case of, oh, I'm sorry, we've committed to those lights. Yeah, we, we totally ran a red light there. Never mind. I'll keep quiet if you do. Are you stopping for that one, though? You know, you've had enough warning to stop for that one. So yeah, I do hope that I'm proved wrong. And that they do actually release the updates at some point this year. Maybe there's quite a lot to do, you just never know, do you? I mean, maybe they've uh, already cottoned on to the idea that I had about removing quite a lot of the, the textures that you don't need. Oh, dear me, this is uh, getting very laggy, isn't it? Uh, for those people that continually ask, when are you next doing London? Uh, you know, why are you not doing London? Uh, you, you don't, you've not done London in ages. Uh, this is one of the main reasons the performance is just so bad. Uh, I don't really enjoy driving on London as much as some of the other maps. Don't get me wrong, it's a good map. There's a lot of effort that's clearly gone into it, but uh, the performance... You know, if you can get really good performance on Arcala and West Country, why would you not drive them? There we go. I've always liked that green uh, new Route Master. Always enjoyed uh, seeing that one. It just looks good, doesn't it, in that, that old London transport colour. This junction's weirdly narrow. There we go. Get your foot down. Come on. Oh, are we stopping here? I don't think anybody's... Nope, that wo woman's not walking up to the bus stop, is she? So obviously we're not stopping there. Oh, hang on, that's a bit... A uh, little bit firm on the old brake in there. Go, go, go! Go. Let's make sure that we actually stop this time. Have we got a camera so that we can see our rear door? Uh, it does not appear so. That's a shame. Oh, what's happening now? Roadworks three way traffic control up ahead. Have the roadworks changed? No, of course they haven't. No, this was always here. I'm getting confused. I'm thinking I'm further on than what I actually am. Go, go, go! Wow, V-Reg taxi in front. And a T-Reg taxi on the right. Flipping heck. I don't think cars that old are allowed in London now, are they? It's like a border guard. It's stood there, ready to, uh, ready to send you back to where you've come from if you're driving in anything older than a template. Time to stop again, there we go, Grove Way. I thought we'd better stop before they've been here. We don't want them thinking that we're making it deliberately difficult. Have we got, uh, where's the, where's the, where's the sheep? There's the sheep. Ah, lovely. Go! What happened there? Flipping heck. Oh, hang on. Yeah, don't pull out in front of that taxi. There we go. I like how there's a sign saying merge lanes. You know, there's the, all these road signs here, but it still has to tell you above. Uh, merge the lanes. Temporary traffic lights. Temporary traffic lights. Bus stop up ahead is closed. Do not stop. Right, okay, so we don't stop there.
So is this the one we don't stop at? Ah, I'm guessing so. Right, well, we've not stopped. Let's get back in that bus lane. It's starting to feel lightheaded, not been in the bus lane. Oh, Prius is coming over. Whoa, are you are you coming over? No, you're letting me go first then. Oh, you've just crashed into the side of me. How kind of you. It's a good job it's not my bus and not my money, isn't it? Go. This really is so much nicer to drive since the update. I can't tell you how much I'm enjoying myself. Really am. There we go, get that door shut. Yeah, as much as I moan about London, I, I really am enjoying this drive this evening, you know? It's nice, isn't it? I think that in in the real London there would be a lot more, uh, a, you know, a lot more traffic. Oh, hang on, that's a Range Rover that's parked. I, was, I thought he was going to move shortly. Better get out of that lane then, haven't we? There we go. Go. You know, I've completely lost where I am. We used to drive this all the time, didn't we? And now we just don't. I, I really need to familiarise myself with it. Right, hang on. So this is a timing point. Uh, right, okay. Uh, 415, yeah, timing point. Does someone want to get off yet? Yeah, stop request. Well, we shall stop then. There we go. Right, let's get them doors shut. Oh, who's still getting off now? Nobody. Oh, that flipping stop bell. Right, so we go across into this lane, do we? That's how we do it. Yeah, we go across into this lane and round. That's how we do it. Because left would take you down there. I remember that because I used to get that to get that mixed up all the time, didn't I? The rev counter as well, if you look, just slowly kind of throbbing. Right, it seems to have idled. Uh, it seems to have evened itself out now. Yeah, it was kind of hunting a little bit. Go! Come on! Green light. Oh, they're not in a rush, these cars, this evening, are they? You'd have thought the taxi drivers would have been absolutely bombing it round to, to try and get as many fares as they could on a Saturday night, but uh, no. Alas, not. Right, so we don't stop there. Come on, straight across into this lens. Carry on forward. Follow that Prius. There we go, so we stop here. Yeah, we don't want to accidentally go left. I've done that before. Realised I was going the wrong way. Right, so yeah, we're at the, we've split off from the Route 3 now, so this is the road that takes us down to Elephant and Castle, isn't it? I've got you. I'm with you. Right, let's just slow right down for these lights. So that we can absolutely floor it off the lights. 
Hooray, there we go. And beat the taxi. It's not a taxi, it's a Prius. I'm just automatically assuming it's a taxi because it's a Prius. We have a lot of Prius taxis where I'm from. Oh, dear me, yeah, you can tell we're approaching Elephant and Castle, can't you? The uh, frame rates are starting to have a little bit of a... Uh, ooh. Although, to be fair, for the amount of complaining I'm doing about the frame rates, this is a lot better than it used to be. You know, we've got to remind ourselves of that. It's a lot better than it used to be. You know, small victories, small victories. Oh, green light. It's like they knew we were coming, didn't Where are we? Kennington Kennington Station? Oh, Kennington Station. Ah, that's on the northern line, if uh, if I remember rightly. Do some services terminate at Kennington? I'm not sure, to be honest with you. I'm not sure what's going on with this gearbox. Maybe it's uh, not quite finished. I'm not sure. I'm sure that... What I am sure of is that uh, either reverse idle or... First Enviro are going to put me in my place regarding this. Uh, me mentioning the gearbox, they're either going to say, Yeah, it's meant to be like that. Do you not know anything about Enviro 400s? Or they are going to tell me, Yeah, we, we need to put a bit of work into that. Uh, I'm not too sure which one it is, to be honest with you. It might just be a small bug. Uh, it might be that it's actually meant to be like that. And I'm complaining about nothing. There we go. Let's get them doors shut. So I think we'll, no, we'll stay in this left hand lane. I think that's what we do here, because we go off to the, well we don't turn left, but we we go forwards in the left lane, don't we? So I think we'll continue to do that. I mean I'm taking up the whole road anyway, so it doesn't really matter, does it? When we're flipping back ends sticking out again, look at that! Well I work with a chap that looks like him. There we go, come on, go, go, go. Oh, that would be a curb that you've just hit with your back wheel. Oh, don't do that when you do your driving test. Be sending you straight home. far from Elephant and Castle now, are we? Is this the next bit where we go past the station? I think it is, you know. Oh. No, oh, we stopped. I didn't. I've noticed as well we've got no announcements because I've not put the, the whatchamacallit up there. Way, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stop. We, we did this last time, didn't we? You were too busy looking round all where you were meant to be going. Or everywhere else except where you were meant to be going. Uh, yeah, we didn't put the. If we'd have put this in, we might have got some announcements. But never mind. I can cope without announcements, can't you? Just this once. I mean, that's not exactly. Brilliant road position in there, is it? Slap bang in the middle. Ah, oh, well. Nobody complained. Weirdly enough, OMSI passengers haven't been speaking to me as of recent. Do, does anyone know how you can fix that? It's very weird. Maybe I've accidentally turned it off in the settings. I know there was a frightening amount of Scousers that were uh, in OMSI 2 add on London. There we go. Just took behind this route master, assuming it's not going to uh, change lanes.
There's not many on, is there, to say it's a Saturday night. Oh, I think there's some joker that's messing about with the bell. Can somebody tell that child he can't stand upstairs. There we go, so we're going to end up going round to the right here, aren't we? I think some other routes branch off. Yeah, 415 straight on. Oh, yeah, it's a bit laggy, isn't it? Keep going, keep going, keep going. It'd be quite good if they made an, uh, an Evo Seti single door. I don't know which lane I'm meant to be in. Yeah, straight, straight round to the right for the 415. Lovely. And then do we go forwards? Yes, I believe we do. Very difficult when you've got someone driving alongside you to uh, not to hit them. I don't know if the roads are this narrow, they might be, but it just seems very kind of like buses will cause a lot of congestion round here. Flipping heck, another timing point. We'll shut the back door while this lot are getting on because it takes much longer, doesn't it? The back door to shut. Right, off we go. God, we've lost a bit of time, you lot getting on. It's a shame we don't have a red one, isn't it? I think we'd fit more, we'd feel more like, like we were at home in a red bus. We do kind of stick out like a sore thumb being uh, completely white, don't we? Ghostly white. Ooh, off we go again. Right, Rodney Place. Are people really still getting on? We're so close to the end of the route, nearly. Well, we're not nearly so close to the end of the route. We are so close to the end of the route. We're practically there now. In fact, I think this is it down here, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Bricklayer's Arms, New Kent Road. Fantastic. Well, uh, I do hope that you have enjoyed this run. And, uh, oh, hang on, flipping heck. I don't think I can go through that one, can I? Yeah, I do hope you've enjoyed this run in Add-on London with the, uh, with the Enviro 400mmc by Studio Polygon. Uh, the version 1.2 update, of course. Uh, I can conclude uh, that this is an absolutely brilliant bus. There is a link in the description if you've not already got it. Now, um, the link at the time of the video, or the link, sorry, will be to the current version. Uh, the version 1.2 is not currently released at the time of recording. Uh, now, when it is released, uh, if you do own the current version, uh, then it will automatically download. So you won't have to do anything, you don't have to go on their website, it'll just download if you purchased it through Steam, uh, so you won't have to do anything with that. And uh, like I say, if it is a case of it's been released, you might be watching this three years after it's happened, uh, then of course the link below will get you the updated version. To conclude, to put my teeth in, try again. So to conclude, I think this is an absolutely brilliant bus and you should be really, really excited. I don't know quite why we aren't really ghostly white. Maybe it's because we're just under that lampshade. Uh, yeah, to conclude, I would be really excited if I were you guys. This is a fantastic bus, and it really does feel uh, feel brilliant to drive. Thank you so much for watching today. If you have enjoyed today's video, please do make sure that you click the like button, because it helps the video do better, and I'm more likely to produce more content like this. And of course, if you haven't already, subscribe. Uh, we'll be driving the MMC again. We'll be looking at other new things that are coming for OMSI 
in the future. So make sure you subscribe uh, so that you don't miss out on any of that juicy new OMSI related material. Other than that, thanks so much for watching and hopefully I shall see you all next time. Cheerio. Goodbye for now.